Hey everybody, hope everybody is doing well this Monday night. Welcome to Note Night in America. Um, hopefully everybody's having a wonderful time. It is a nice chilly evening here in Austin, Texas. Uh, excited to be back here after being really on the road the last two weeks uh, with everything. So thanks for those of you that showed up on time that are here. Got some great stuff uh, that we're going to be covering tonight. Honestly, this is probably one of my favorite webinars that I do, and I've done this the past three years, is... We go to an event like Traffic Inversion, so I'm going to come back and share the really cool tools and tricks that we learned from the event that I thought going to be valuable for you. But before we get into that tonight, once again, welcome to Dope Night in America. We're excited that you guys are all here. Um, we've got a variety of people who are on the call tonight. They're joining us that are registered for the event. Uh, we have Note on real estate investors, obviously. We also have people interested in investing in notes or buying notes. Uh, these calls are recorded. Boom, I did hit the record button, so we're live. There, we're also live streaming this to YouTube. Uh, for those that uh, can't watch the entire time, you can jump over and follow us on our We Close Notes channel on YouTube and catch the, the live YouTube uh, stream of that as well. Uh, of course, always, these calls are recorded. We'll throw the replays up on WeCloseNotes.tv as well for those that uh, are joining us here or can't make it this time around. So uh, let me just pull up my YouTube channels where I can answer any questions. We'll get rock and roll here as well. Uh, make sure you subscribe though, because we do uh, put these episodes on iTunes as our Note Night in America podcast there for you. So that's there. Uploaded uh, new episodes yesterday for all of February. So those should be up rock and roll along on iTunes as well for everybody out there that are listening. So Really excited about uh, tonight's topic, everybody. Um, we got some big news, though, that we wanted to roll out to you guys as well. We uh, at 420 episodes now for the Note Closer Show podcast, 250,000 downloads we passed last week. So pretty stoked about hitting that big number for us. It was a big week with the podcast, uh, besides just hitting a quarter million downloads. Um, I'm speaking this weekend in Orlando at PodFest. They asked me to come out and speak how we were able to get the six figures in uh, our first 12 months. But I'd love for you to listen to the Note Close Show, review it, give us a five-star review as well. Uh, lots of great content, interviews, guests, and vendors that we have on a regular basis on the Note Closer Show. So, uh, Gail, thank you so much, very much. Appreciate it. Look forward to seeing you Um in two days, actually, too, at the Lunch and Learn. But um, we just absolutely um, announced this today. The Note Closer Show is going live three days a week, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, across the country on over uh, 16, well, 16 ra FM AM radio stations across the country. And it's actually, I, uh, re refresh, it's going to be broadcast at 9 a.m. across all four time zones. So, Pretty excited about that. This is kind of a big occurrence just happened for us. Um, hey, said, how's it going, bud? Literally, the show has been picked up by these 16 channels. We're really excited about this. Uh, I think this is going to be a big, big game changer for what we're doing. But taking our episodes in uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursdays, we'll have those episodes playing across the country. So pretty stoked about that. We got a question. Great work. Thanks, Thanks, Bill. We are extremely excited about this. Um, if you missed the, the, the podcast today, uh, we actually started off with our first episode being with Quincy. So basically it's a 24 hour delay, but still that's huge for us. Uh, and that number is actually going to pretty rapidly increase. I think we'll be going from 16 radio stations to probably doubling that in the next uh, 30 to 60 days based on some of the connections we made at our, our new media summit event that we went to where uh, I was an icon of influence. It's all about, networking with people, everybody, and uh, this awesome connection um, really uh, it's just coming from a relationship that you developed over the last eight months. And so very excited about this. Thank you for the kind words for everybody. So um, just we're going on to bigger, better things with this aspect of things. So it's all about media these days. But I uh, wanted to let you guys know about upcoming events. It's important. Many of you are curious. 
Uh, no, they won't be live with calling questions, but we'll probably be doing live episodes the day before so that your questions can be aired on the radio stations across the country. So something to keep in mind there as well. Um, we have some events that you guys want to make sure and mark down your calendar. Lunch and Learn is this Wednesday, March 6th in Orlando at the uh, Wyndham Resort Hotel on International Drive. Love to have you. It's I'll go more into that later on. Uh, but this weekend, March 7th to the 10th, is also in Orlando. I'll be there uh, for PodFest Multimedia Expo. The podcast will be there, but I'm speaking Saturday at that event as well. So excited about that. If you're in that necklace, come out and say hi. Love to visit with you. I had a great time last uh, week and a half ago with the uh, Tampa Note Closers group that Nahir put together. And, and great. We're honored to have uh, Tyler Chef and my buddy uh, uh, Sean Yesner come out from the uh, Crushing Debt podcast and the Cashflow Guys podcast. And the one, the only Jeff Watson made an appearance incognito, kind of hanging out. But uh, excited for last week with that. Fast track training uh, for March is in two weeks. We have only two spots left available. If you want to kick off your money, get a kick off your note business and you start making some money in this first quarter, hey, the opportunity for you to do that. Note Camp 7, April 4th through the 8th. Uh, I'm sorry, 4th through the 7th. I keep putting the 8th on there. Well, the 8th was always the Monday night afterwards. So that's actually right. But that's online. You can go to notecamp.live to get your discounted tickets now. The website will be updated here in the next week for that event. We've got some cool things that we may do. We may be putting Note Camp Live on the radio across those 16 channels later in the evenings as well. Uh, April 19th to the 21st is our April Fast Track training. We do have two spots available for that. And then the following week will be the Note Mastermind here in Austin, April 26th to the 28th. So we've got a very busy April and March for those that are looking to really get tapped in to some things here locally, but then also in other places as well. So uh, like I said, mentioned before, this Wednesday from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m., it's a special lunch and learn. We call it note lunch. Lunch is actually covered, included in the cost. Uh, it's $97. Um, also, if you use the discount code SCOTT, S-C-O-T-T, when you go to notelunch.com, Scott, it should knock 50 bucks off for you. All right. 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. I'm honored to have Quest Trust Company being a sponsor. Honored to have paperstack.com come as a sponsor as well. So we're expecting roughly out of around 50 people at the event there. And we may be live streaming it. Live streaming. If you're interested, um, we may do a live stream and, and still give you the same discount. Once you, you know, 47 for a live stream for five hours, that's not so bad, but it'll be definitely dedicated. Uh, Tyler's a good friend. We had a great dinner, him and his wife, with me and Steph uh, last Wednesday evening while we were in San Diego for the Traffic and Conversion Summit. Uh, I love his story. Does a, does a tremendous job. He's got a big passion for helping people. So we'll be talking about raising capital, finding deals, owner financing, creative financing structure. We're talking some case studies. Like I said, self-directed IRAs. Paper Stack's bringing in a, a couple of portfolios that just uploaded as well to their platform. So got some great stuff that we'll be sharing. I, I promise it is not a pitch session. It is content for those five hours. I think I have a big shout out to the head of PodFest Multimedia Expo, Chris Cremosis, who really uh, said, hey, you guys want to have an event? Have a half day event here with us. So pretty stoked about that as well. Like I said, if you go to notelunch.com, if you're in the Orlando or Central Florida region, come on out. You're going to have a great time. Trust me. Well, heck, if you only, if, I mean, if 10 people on the ship, we're still having a good time. But we're pretty excited about this special event. If you'd like to, let me know. I can shoot you a link over for the live stream link. And uh, we can see about getting you a, a, a live stream access there for the uh, 47 bucks if you're interested. So anyway, once again, we've got Lone Tales. I do have one or two chapters left available to you. This is uh, very exciting. We've been taking some great interviews from some of those that are signed up for this. Um, love to have you as well. If you're interested in getting your own chapter written, sharing your story and a, and a case study or two, it's maybe interesting or your bread and butter. Love to have you. We got, I've already got asset managers that actually have been asking me about this. I don't know if they saw it on my profile or what, but they're interested in, in reading the stories. Uh, they're interested in seeing who's part of the book, which is kind of funny. So really excited about that. Um, also have had a couple requests from different real estate investment clubs asking that once we go live with this, they'd love for us to come out and talk about this. So some great opportunities uh, to get in front of a lot of people with us doing a lot of the marketing for you. Like I said, it's still $5.99. There's not 15 chapters left. There's two chapters left. So I'd love to have you. If you're interested, 
Sign up at loantails.com. Is that ever RSV your chapter? You don't have to worry about writing anything. I get on the phone. We interview you. We take the audio, and my ghostwriter takes it and runs with it. And we go from there. Um, questions, comments, concerns before I dive into uh, one bit of nugget, a bit of housekeeping, and a couple changes that we're making here. Maybe popular, may not be popular. I don't know. But what uh, do we have any questions about the previous events? Uh, anything we discussed on uh, before we dive into the next update? One thing to keep in mind too, as I mentioned before, with the uh, anybody that has a chapter in Lone Tales, we'll be having you on the Note Closer Show podcast. Which, besides going out to all our online iTunes, that will be rolled out across our sixteen radio stations. So, if you ever want to be interviewed on sixteen AM FM radio stations across the country, it might just be worth your time to sign up for a chapter then and go from there. Something to keep in mind. You've closed on a note deal, originated note. Hey, take the time to get signed up at loantails.com. All right. All right. Moving on. We've got a little bit of housekeeping tonight. We're making some changes here with some things. Uh, and it, it affects Note Night in America. It affects, it affects these webinars that we do every Monday night. Now, uh, we are still planning on having three to four of these every month, like we normally do. Uh, but we're going to be making a couple changes. And um, the first Monday will be open to everybody like it's always been, but the following second through fourth Mondays of the month will be only for WC and membership only. So they will not be open to everybody in the public anymore. Um, with us tweaking a few things, we believe that a lot of people can get a lot of great information if you uh, view our podcast. We'd love to have you listen to the podcast. Um, but the really nuts and bolts of what we want to do, we want to deliver to our WCN membership members. And that's what we really plan on doing. Uh, with our members, we're no longer be doing a Wednesday coaching call. Most of them are used to tuning in on Monday night. So we'll be just instead of doing one coaching call a month, there'll be two to three coaching calls per month for our WCN members uh, group out there. Now, um, if you're a WCN membership, great. You just got your Wednesday nights back. Just join us in Monday night here and it'll be dedicated directly to you. Uh, we will be uploading the episodes uh, a couple of weeks in, onto our podcast and then the Note Night in America podcast, but they'll just be audios. They will not be videos. No, we will not be uploading the videos to YouTube for public consumption either. So love to have you if you're interested. We just provide so much great content on here. Um, that's what we're here for. So you can sign up at the uh, price uh, for the WCNmembership.com to get access to those live calls. At ninety-seven dollars a month, that also includes swag. I am also sporting the newest T-shirt to come out, the Dollar Bill Shield. Uh, for those that are part of the WCN membership, this is the shirt that's coming out with some other goodies this month in the swag bags. So, a little dollar sign there for you. Dollar, not not quite a superhero, but kind of the Superman, the super investor. This is the shirt that's coming out this month. So, get signed up. WCNmembership.com. Give it a second. Takes the, the, the website to forward there. It's $97 a month. You got all the replays. Uh, dig that shirt. Can I have two? <laughs> Drop me an email, Jeffrey Wolf. I will send you an extra one because you showed up to the uh, the the, or, the San Diego Note Closers group. Okay? But uh, drop me a separate email so I can make sure Shannon drops you out a separate one there for it. But like, like I said, if you're part of the WC membership, a lot of you that are on here, great. Nothing's going to really change except you'll get your Wednesday nights back. If you're not a part of it, hey, take advantage of it. Get signed up for the WC membership at $97 a month. And, and based on the discounts we provide, based on the savings, based on the discounts of the events, like some of you guys went to the, uh, the NIS this last weekend, you got $100 off that ticket. You've got 20% or 20 bucks off the upcoming Distressed Mortgage Expo this week. You know, there's a lot of great things we do with that to help you provide you savings. If I can't make you or save you $97 a month with a membership, I'm doing something wrong. All right. So this will go into effect starting next Monday night as well. So um, some of those that didn't tune in, they're going to be a little disappointed. Like, eh, well, we'll be making the announcement as well there for you. So I'd love to have you on Note Night in America, guys and gals. I think we provide a ton of content on there. A lot of great discounts. We're just wanting to focus uh, and take things a little bigger that way. And I think that's the only way we can do that with that is to take it a little bit bigger and just do it here on Monday nights where everybody's used to it as well. Love to have you. If you don't want to be a part of it, that's completely fine. 
we respect that. Uh, you'll still be able to tune in on the first Mondays, but just not the second through the fourth Mondays any further. We're also frees up a little extra time for me as well, too. So any questions about that stuff before we dive into the nuts and bolts of what uh, you came here for this evening? Any questions, comments, concerns? Remember, if you're a WCN member, you get access to Note Camp. You get access to our virtual workshops and able to repeat those as well at no additional cost along with the other bonuses. That's over a thousand dollar value right there. Being able to repeat and get that information. Okay. All right, let's move it on. Tools and tricks from Traffic and Conversion Summit 2019. Now, the Traffic and Conversion Summit is the largest marketing event put on in North America. Over 60, I think 6,200 people attended or bought tickets to this event. And there was over 5,000 people there for sure. It took place in San Diego uh, on the 25th through the 27th of February. This is the fifth time I've attended. I think the fourth time Steph has gone. Absolutely amazing event. 200 plus vendors, digital entrepreneurs. As I mentioned before, I'm a big believer that besides the note business, we're all in the media business. And that way you get your word out and what you're doing either to raise capital, to find deals or close deals, is by leveraging your media, leveraging your marketing. And there's a lot of great things that we go through. And fortunate for me, I was very blessed early on in my real estate, hang on here, in my real estate investing journey to really be mentored by an amazing individual who's one of the main principals of traffic conversion, a guy by the name of Roland Frazier. And Roland, uh, absolutely amazing individual, one of the smartest marketers when it comes to everything. He often has two or three presentations that take place each traffic conversion. And I always try to go to those uh, because I always get an amazing nugget. It makes it worth the whole ticket price. And it's not a cheap ticket to, to really go because I learn something new every time I go. It becomes extremely, extremely valuable to me. And Steph is also gets a lot of stuff out, but when we walk out of it, we often feel all the times like we want to blow up our business, <laughs> okay? Um, not just blow it up, but kind of start with some different things and do some things differently with it. And we've been lucky enough over the last couple of years to do some amazing things and, and, and really kind of expand the brand and really help a lot of our, our students out there. I mean, the WCN membership came from last year's Traffic Conversion Summit. It, it helped us with a lot of our online training. The Note Blueprint was originally started there at Traffic Conversion Summit. So the idea to do the online event started at Traffic Conversion Summit originally as well a few years back. Thanks to Steph and um, her really kind of being instrumental and said, well, why don't we do this? And why can't you do this? And like, you know what? You're 100% right. So I know like Jeffrey Wolf mentioned when we were in San Diego talking last Thursday night on the 28th for the San Diego group. A lot of people like this webinar, like what we're going to talk about, because I share the greatest tips and tools on it. And so what I wanted to share with you is I always like to go, do I have it pulled up here or not? Um, hang on here. Oops, I have it up here. Okay. So, boom, shaka blocka. So Roland, he shares his presentations on SlideShare. Every presentation he does, he, he shares there. And he had four presentations, one on tools, best marketing tools that they use for digital marketer, which is doing tons and tons of business. 17 unique, unique marketing tweaks for you. You can copy, proven to drive instant guaranteed results. The bulletproof copy instantly and easily create uniquely effective marketing campaigns using the proven what to say when magic messaging method models great. And it's achieving unicorn growth. We're not going to go through those three. We are just going to go through the tools one, the best marketing tools from the traffic and conversion summit. Okay. And let me do this, expand it full screen. There we go. You want to download this? You can literally go straight to slideshare.net and type in Roland Frazier and find his slides there. Now, the thing is, he it's 132 images here. We are going to go through this relatively quickly. There are going to be some great nuggets that you're going to want to do. There are going to be some that I'm probably going to skip over that most of you are never going to use. All right. But I think there are some of the, you guys will get quite a bit of content. I'll just be like, ah, I'll go back later on. But the tools that Roland shared here, this is amazing. So here's one of the first ones, buildwith.com. If you ever wanted to find out what websites are built with, if you like a website or you want to see what kind of platform, what kind of technology on, here's where you do it. Built 
builtwith.com. Type in the website. They'll tell you exactly what that person has built their website with. Okay. All right. Where's my next one? The next one, um, data, datanize.com. Uh, this is the same thing if you're wanting to see what kind of services or some type of other websites they're using. This is a great website to use this as well to help you build some cool graphics or other cool plugins that they might use. Really, really cool. Now, those are a couple. Into, now, if you want to use competitive intelligence, this is really phenomenal. Uh, I, I absolutely love this slide. So competitive intelligence tools, they, as you can see, 132 slides are not all there. There's literally hundreds of websites out here as well. So similarweb.com allows to give you detailed desktop mobile traffic, demographic popular pages there, ad histories on AdBeat, uh, iSpionage, customer journey from ad network creative to, to the landing pages, SEM Rush, which is just a beautiful way to look at your SEO keyword research for your, your tabs and your videos. Uh, Gail, I think you were going to love that one. Uh, Ahrefs helps you with bad uh, backlinks and keyword competitive. Ghostry.com. This is all sorts of, they got some cool uh, extensions on Chrome. If you're wanting to take a look at uh, who's mailing what, that's direct mail plus email campaign performance tracking. Uh, it, it's a pretty, pretty cool thing. Crayon, it's a competitive intelligence tool on product launch, launches and site changes and price tracking. Tubular Labs, this is really kind of one I like. It's video intelligence, performance tracking, and leaderboards. I can look at other things. Alexa.com, web ranking, and competitive intelligence. The ones in green are what he considers essential and the black are optional. Data Miner, he used to use this a lot more, but it discovers high impact news before the media does. Some of you guys are creating blogs or want to use articles. Great one. What runs where, that also is kind of a competitive ad intelligence tool. And follow.net, it's low end, all in one ad intelligence. Pretty easy. To follow there for you. Um, some great, great websites there as well. So let's talk about some content marketing. And a lot of people struggle. How do you come up with all the content, Scott? I sit around. That's all I do. No. Some great websites here. Hawkeye AI. Oh, it will help you find some really cool stuff and get it shared out there across social media. Groupi.com. This is the world's largest blogger database. So you can literally find people that, that have already blogs and you can use this to help share across your website, your articles, things like that. Bassclicks.com. Uh, it turns curated content into leads. You can kind of see it gives you a nice dashboard. Uh, it, basically, it's kind of like a, a advanced Snipply for some of you guys that are using Snipply out there. Okay. Storybase. It's another thing for finding content for you in different articles. Marketmuse.com. Uh, this is the same thing. Build, plan, and optimize your content with AI, not man hours. So it really kind of helps you identify different things to use uh, and, uh, you know, plan and, and accordingly help you really kind of automate some stuff. Expertise Finder. Oh, this is a good one to find journalists to find ap uh, uh, academics. If you're wanting to find somebody to get quoted on, this is a great website that they use. The journalists use all the time to find somebody to get quoted so 30,000 plus vetted experts and, and journalists and experts out there, academics. You may want to go register to yourself. Okay. So some of these other ones they consider uh, important, Market Muse, uh, BuzzSumo, find most shared content across most networks is pretty good. Answer the public. It allows for you to type in keywords, any questions for content ideas. Uh, Snipply, uh, it basically allows for you to share an article that makes it look like you're advertising their website. SPJ.org, find professional journalists to create articles if you need somebody to write an article for you too. Helpareporter.com. This is a really cool thing, helpareporter.com. They're looking for you to provide content. So some of the places that I've been quoted on is come from Help a Reporter. I'll go and type in, add myself on there, and you'll find people that are looking for quotes on real estate or things like that, okay? Crowdfire app, uh, it's a bot that coaches you and automates content marketing. Justreachout.com, another place to reach out to journalists directly. And getmemedia.com, get marketing inspiration via search or alerts, and then designer, uh, enter the blog post, site your own, create a PDF lead magnet for you. So if you're looking for something to help drive in opt-ins or articles or things like that, designer is pretty freaking cool. All right. Moving on. It's a long way to go. We may not get through everything tonight. Uh, another tool. Oh, did I miss a tool? Nope, just a blank page. Okay. Swipe.co, profitable market inspiration. This is a real cool thing that you can... Uh, some different things that people are using uh, for marketing. 
Uh, e-commerce, this is if you're going to be charging for some things. Some of you guys are doing other things besides just uh, buying and selling notes. But uh, Zudo.com is a growth e-commerce using uh, push web notification. E easy engagement and, and retargeting of your people. Uh, LTVplus.com is another thing. That'd be growth sales and conversions. So here's kind of the, the basic thing. It, a lot of this is through Shopify. So it gives you different hooks up, sell, cross, plug, promote, um, especially in social media streams. Some of you guys may be offering up a, a, a class or a report or a book. Pretty cool. Uh, Zipify, this is a landing page builder and it works well with Shopify app, ads. And then yachtpo.com. This gives you, it's a Google qualified app, but also helps you with a lot of reviews. And then Correlate for shoppable images solutions. This is really kind of cool. If you want to find an image you're looking for, great place to go. Um, Clavio, it allows for triggered emails and it connects to your mass messenger and some more. So it allows to really send people out to your database. Stamp.io, same thing, SmartSir. Uh, it's a nice kind of cool shoppable video solution. Okay, let's move on here. Uh, Amazon, I'm gonna flip through this because some of you, get, um, there we go. Let's see here. Uh, not really using Amazon for this stuff, so not worry about that. Funnel cart, CMRM tools. Here's some cool stuff here. So clickfunnels.com builds testing funnels quicker, really for you, and instapage.com. Two very key landing pages. If you guys are working deals or have deals you're looking to sell, you may want to use one of these two aspects to help you out with things. Uh, Ubounce.com, fast and easy landing page builder as well. 10-minute funnels. It's a complete drop and drag funnel building solution. Uh, lead pages, we use that for landing pages. But just really kind of a cool... Um, what was I going to say? Funnel builders, website builders, if you need some quick landing pages. So this is one I think is really valuable. Some of you are very familiar with Infusionsoft as your existing CRM tool. Some different ad stuff, okay? Revealbot.com. Uh, this allows some optimiz automation for those that are running Facebook ads on particular, uh, particular deals or other things. A really cool website. Smartio, so smartly.io. <laughs> Same thing helps you with your advertising. They were a vendor at the event as well. Uh, keyword research. A lot of us are, are using the same keywords and you're wondering why you're not getting a lot of traffic. Well, if you're using specific small niche keywords, you are, probably want to start moving to bigger keywords. So this is a great one, grepwords.com. This, uh, let's see here, what was this say? Um, oh yeah, this helps you with local and commercial keywords that'll help you drive traffic. Uh, KeywordEye.com, same thing. It's a, a level data agency level, powered by the most advanced SEO software available. Allows for you to find the keywords to post into your videos, into your blogs, into your LinkedIn profile. Uh, KeywordRevealer.com. This is a thing of using keywords that are low competition. Obviously, when you do a search engine, you see some keywords that uh, do, do rank high. These are other ones that will rank uh, very well, but maybe a little smaller uh, niche, more focused for you. Okay. Uh, once again, here, there's some of the websites that they re recommended. I don't have all night to go through every website. Literally just got this home um, just the other day. A lot of these are I'll be using. Others, these I won't be using. So I highly encourage you to spend a little time working through some of these as well. All right, everybody. To page. Oh, you'll like this. Some of you guys are, are you see all the quizzes that are being created out there. Uh, you may want to use a quiz with your database. You're going to see a few more coming from us over the next few weeks. And this is a really good idea. It helps you identify uh, where people are in their buying with their, or funding aspect of things. So they got all sorts of great um, quizzes, contests, and games that you can post there and kind of help create, help drive engagement. Outgrow.co. This is great content that gets interactive with people for you, helps you design it. Leadquizzes.com. Great. And, I've used this before. I know some of the other marketers in the real estate side are using this. Uh, generating leads feel like riding a roller coaster. Well, they have some really great things to help you identify people in your database. And this is a Glean tool. Same thing. This is a, a tool that helps you if you're launching. If some of you guys are having a podcast out there, uh, Roland's been uh, using Glean to literally help people get 1,500 entries into what he's focused on with the podcast. And it's helped drive is podcast up to number 14 
uh, between uh, the Gary V experience and the Tim Ferriss show just recently with Business Lunch. So really like this uh, tool, Chris Aveni, Gil uh, Greenberg, if you're watching, anybody else that has a podcast, you might want to jump on Gleam and take a look at that. All right. Helps you with different uh, giveaways, different contests as well. All right. Calculoid.com. <laughs> this is a really easy way to engage, collect, and accept payments. Uh, interactive calculating payment web solutions for you on a variety of different things. Some of you that have some things you're looking at moving. Uh, Matraapp.co. Referral marketing platform to launch your pre-launch campaigns in minutes. So if you've got some big things, this would be a good one for you. Upstart.me. Find targeted email newsletters that you can sponsor to promote to your business or side projects. Think about this. There are all sorts of different newsletters that go out there that are looking for sponsors that you can get your face, your logo, your business as a sponsor onto those email newsletter. This is kind of a cool thing if you want to grow an audience. Um, we'll be using this quite a bit over the next few months as well. Pretty excited about this. But anyway, traffic getting tools. They've got a lot of things there. If you've got a, looking to do a start a Facebook Messenger chat, we have many chat. Um, one signal, Gleam. We talked about that. Friendbuy.com. This is kind of a refer a friend engine. Push through. It helps you with web push notifications, lead quizzes, hellobar.com, Yo Rocket. Uh, and there's all sorts of these other, other websites out there to take a look at as well, too, for you. All right. Some SEO tools. I'm going to flip through some of these. Uh, you're going to like this. Save your time on quality link scraping and prospecting with divs. This is pretty cool for scraping information. Uh, Clickflow.com, same thing here. Grow your organic traffic and help you identify this. The, but there's a cool thing on here. SEO WordPress, SEO Presser. It's a WordPress post SEO content plugin. Pretty cool. Pingdom.com. If you go to a website, check your measure your, your page load time. This is helpful as well. Ahrefs research backlinks for you to things. Uh, you want to check your website to see how fast it loads on mobile pages. Mobile friendly test. Uh, remove removes bad backlinks, Slurpee, Google Earth review of your website, which is kind of cool. Uh, YouTube SEO for you guys that are posting video. This is a tool that I'm going to be using quite a bit. Uh, YouTubecockpit.com helps me identify a better SEO optimization, which I'm pretty excited about. And then, of course, you've got SEO Monitor, SEO Ability, and 10.io. Okay, find out where your traffic came from. Moving on here, LinkedIn Helper. Okay. This is kind of a cool thing to help you expand your LinkedIn, all right? By, it uses LinkedIn Helper to help you expand and get targets and expand your network. So some of you that may be like, oh, crap, I can't export my contacts anymore. This could still help you get boosted your profile to help people find out for you. Get them to opt in to your, some of your things you're posting on there. So this is not the exact back, best tool, hey, I'm going to export contacts, but this is a great way to get in front of more contacts on LinkedIn, all right? So Jeffrey Wolf, that one's for you, buddy. Um, Agora Pulse, same thing as the last read, kind of organizing your social media and management. Got a free trial there for you, it's not too bad. Hypergrowth.com, same thing. Grow your Instagram and Twitter profiles with these two. We're pretty excited about this. Onehypegrowth.com, if you're trying to grow your audiences across those two platforms. Ducksoup.com. Same thing, smarter way to generate new business using LinkedIn. Easy way to find and engage with your prospects on LinkedIn, okay? Socialmonials.com, uh, uh, same thing. Social media automation so, so, self-optimizes uh, for revenue. Or it's a little bit different type of buffer or uh, Hootsuite. Power Ad Spy, this is kind of a Facebook ad intelligence. You can see what people are using with their ads on Facebook, okay, anyleads.com, uh, leads drive traffic, great content for your lead generation as well. It's a pretty cool little website. I mess around with that much, but um, rev.com, you guys are familiar with this. Uh, if you're doing videos, I've, I, this is something I went back and I'm gonna be adding quite a bit, is the captions help out people read, because a lot of people will watch YouTube, but they watch the videos on silence. They can't necessarily read lips. So adding captions back to your videos at a dollar per minute is, is valuable and it will boost your uh, views out there. So that's one thing we have not been doing, but it was a tip I got from on, and we'll implement it and go from there. Uh, there's another thing too, foreign language captions. You might want to, they'll do it for three to $7 a minute 
um, usually in 24 hours, you may want to add, if you've got Spanish speaking in your uh, Spanish, Latin or anything like that, it's, you have a different language that you are around or people around, you may want to use this to help drive traffic different foreign languages. It's kind of a different idea. But anyway, same thing you see the other social tools, Ad Espresso, uh, lots for you to generate thousands of Facebook ads quickly, Catvertiser, um, same thing, Drift Rock, Dynamic Social Ads, FB, F, Facebook Pixel Helper, helps you with a, a Facebook Pixel plugin, Follower Wonk, Twitter Follower Tool, Meet Edgar, same thing, it's kind of a hoot suite. Sprinkler is pretty good. Make me reach Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, ad campaign automation, so it can really help you out with some things there as well. Okay. The list. What's this the list about? Uh, oh, leader in email signature marketing. Being able to use your signature to help you market is a pretty cool thing. Bombbomb.com. This is kind of a cool thing. When you get people to sign up, they allow you to set up and send automatic or send uh, customized videos. Uh, to people for those that signed up. Pretty kind of a cool thing. Mailshake.com, same thing. Solution for cold emails. Helps you generate and build relationships out there. This is kind of, you've got a big list that's old. Uh, voila, voila, Norbert.com. This can help you find anybody's email address. All right? Anybody emails address. So you may want to take a look at it. If you're looking for somebody specifically as an asset manager that you can't export to contact off of LinkedIn, this may be helpful. And it's actually... Pretty freaking cool. Some of the things I ran, I was like, oh my gosh, I got an email to somebody very important that I'm excited about, okay? But there's a whole bunch of things. Uh, Bright Verify, this email verification might be something you want to use if you're uploading lists. Full contact, email auto search, return path, same thing. It's email verification. You guys are used to Survey Monkey with me. Plus this, if you got to use Infusionsoft, this adds a whole lot of tools to Infusionsoft. Meripost is a big enterprise email service, Wicked Reports. There's a lot of great uh, CRM reporting reports you can use with your lead gen. Sherpa metrics allows for you to also look at your numbers. 250 OK, email health monitoring system. Twilio, which is pretty cool. Voice, SMS, and video marketing. You may want to take a look at that. Okay. And of course, Fusionsoft, you're familiar with that. Okay. Uh, TubeBuddy.com. This is, like I said before, great place to help you with your keyword search for YouTubes. Uh, it installs free for Chrome. Tube Shift, other th one they use. Uh, if you're going to be using YouTube advertiser, uh, advertising YouTube, use Loom.com. Send a video down a thousand words. Have you get your message across through instantly shareable videos? Pretty cool for that. Lumen 5, same thing, more videos. VidIQ, grow your YouTube channel for free. Onlinefreetools.com. This is kind of a not the easiest link out there. Uh, but it extracts the tags from a YouTube video. You type the URL into it and it'll extract the tags on there and you understand which, which one that you should be using, okay? So pretty cool. Slidely, create slideshow videos is one of the great things. Go animate. Some of you guys are familiar with it. That allows for you to uh, create animated cartoon videos. Uh, ClipChamp is a video compression tool that makes it load faster on your website. Uh, Handbrake will also be a video transcoder for you, so help out there. And there's also some other ones like Animoto, Video Scribe. Uh, video Scribe is pretty cool. It creates whiteboard doodle videos based on your uh, text and a lot, bunch of the other ones there. So just some great, great stuff out there. All right. Uh, live streaming stuff, you know, saying BeLive.tv or BeLiveTV.com uh, is a good thing we've been using. Some of the, you've seen it for the podcast. Restream.io. We are going to be using a lot of this going forward, restreaming. You share it one place, it can share it across the border everywhere else. Uh, LiveReacting.com, another thing. Wait for you to stream pre-recorded videos. Make it look like it's live. LiveLeak.com is another one we use quite a bit to share our stuff across different platforms. Um, those are some really cool stuff there. But images, if you're looking for images, custom images, here you go. Photofeeler.com. Uh, is a great place. There's also Canva you guys are familiar with, pick to chart. Um, here's another thing that's real nice. Place your image on phone, computer, TV screens. Place it.net. So you want to put your logo on like the TV screen or you want to place uh, your face on it. It's kind of a cool thing that allow you to do that. Uh, but they put literally, uh, he put a lot of great stuff. The gift maker. Uh, he said this was, if you have like a YouTube video, you can go to giftmaker.com put your Facebook video in there, YouTube video, it'll create a gift for you that can help 
uh, people reach engagement with you. I, was, I thought it was awesome. Retargeting. I know not many people on here are using retargeting, but pixelme.me, it's a great way for you to do that. Pixelyoursite.com, where you can put uh, all sorts, if you've got a WordPress site, put pixels up there. And opt-in monster is a great way to convert visitors and subscribers. We'll be using some of this stuff here with some of the other stuff that we use as well. And then there's some influencers out here, how to find influencers. Intellifluence.com, uh, it's a simple way to get reviewed, build awareness, increase sales. So if you want uh, to be a micro-influencer, a lot of people are using that in marketing. Um, also, if you have an influencer program, monitor influence, clear.com will allow you to do that. Some things we'll probably mess around with recently, lately. Uh, influencerfee.com talks about if you want to be an influencer for people, how much you can earn and finds goes out and finds some, uh, some great things there for 10 bucks a month for you. For those that love numbers, analytics, some analytics tools for you. Nachoanalytics.com. This is spying any website's analytics so you can see exactly what they're doing. N.ripe.com, same thing. Being able to scribe on that there. But they've got all sorts of analytics tour. And that's one thing you want to look at. There's so many great ways to spy in the competition to see what they're using and if it's effective. Conversion optimization, visible.com. This allows for you to identify behavior and data on your sales and outcomes. And see how they go. Intercom.com, same thing. It's great for sales, marketing, and support. Uh, Amazon.com Polly, Amazon Polly allows for you to turn, turn text into lifelike speech using deep learning. So you can literally use this, especially with your, uh, this will help with uh, all the Amazon echoes and things like that. Take what you and it puts it in a word that's identified by those guys. Landbot.io, same thing. Websites of conversational experiences, which is pretty cool. Schedulewonce.com. It's an integrated scheduling platform, so it's kind of helping you out, kind of like a Calendly. Uh, Geofill.com, it helps you with your, increase your time on site, conversion rates, and, and uh, clicks. So if you're getting people to your website, but you're wondering why you know people aren't opting in, you may want to check this out. Wizgo, bring some zing with a convincing personalization. This things to help you personalize some of their uh, landing pages and other things on your website, so it's personalized to the person that comes to it. Pingdom.com. Same thing, it monitors your website and identifies opportunities. And you get better at your website. Leadconnect.cc, um, same thing. This helps you with new leads coming to your website and, and gets that going. Then crankwill.com. This is if you get somebody that uh, opts into something, this will help crank it up and either put it to your salesperson or deliver it to you so you can make a, a quick phone call. Because basically they, they, they do that, the person, the, the company or the website that responds the fastest often closes a sale 78% of the time. So if you got any type of real estate or other things, this is a good thing if you're doing where you're doing types of postcards or things like that. Pushover.net, same thing. It's kind of a push text messaging service straight to your contacts. Connect.io, same thing. Easily, uh, it auto responds, your uh, Facebook and message systems, kind of like a chat bot. Browserstack.com. <laughs> uh, this will help you instant access to 2,000 plus real mobile devices and browsers. Kind of a cool thing to help you out with your uh, being able to communicate with people all at once, 2,000 of them. Privy.com. 98% of people who visit your site never convert. So it allows for you to capture emails, re reduce abandonment growth sales uh, with onsite displays and automated emails, which is pretty cool. Profitwell. Same thing helps you with subscription matrix, rejoiner.com. Um, they let you go out and help people actually opt back in to your emails. So they got a whole sorts of all sorts of conversion optimization there for you. All right. Some of the social pages out there. This is some stuff you might as well might enjoy. Directheroes.com, social CRM and direct messaging solution manage all your customer support marketing with ease. So it's really kind of an automated bot for you. Like a chat bot. Tobound.com, same thing if you use your Facebook groups out there. Uh, this is something that we're going to be doing with our groups. Um, tells us a little bit more in depth about our members. So we're pretty stoked about that. But it's all sorts of mini chat, chat kit, meet Edgar, chat fuel, link tree. Lots of great things that you can use out there to really kind of take your website and social to different levels. Some personalization websites, nadyimages.com. 
This allows for you to literally put some, your somebody's name directly into it. So this Taylor here, you can put this in a whole bunch of different images. So if you have something you're personalizing, maybe to your IRA investors, you could upload an image in your email where it goes out and it automatically customizes with their first and or last name too. So kind of a cool tool to help you out that. This also uh, inter integrates your existing website with your email marketing database to help you out with some right messages to help you get the things out. Swerve.com, uh, this is, it helps with mobile engagement. Um, so there's some pretty cool, but Evergage is one of the ones that they thought was essential and the other ones eh, were optimal based on what you're doing. And I would agree based on what uh, Roland was sharing with everybody. Um, if you need some help with business operations, team tools, Here's some of those gongo, bond.co, handwritten notes at scale. If you're going to do a, a bunch of handwritten notes and things. Christmas time, birthdays. If you're going to do a bunch at once, this might be a cool tool for you to use, getting out letters to people. All right. Modoc.com, sends a portfolio of global business solutions for leads, ringless voicemail, telephone, print and ad media. Uh, the ringless voicemail is also kind of cool, like the slide... Uh, a slide dial that we've used, something like that, okay? All right, going back here. Oops, where's my slides? Otter, same thing. Search and share your voice conversations with people, so it's a way to take your voice and get it out. Loop.co. Uh, this helps with even employee training. Uh, Kite AI, same thing if you're going to be sharing different projects with partners, things like you may want to use that. Monday.com helps you kind of manage and organize and track your week, your day. Same thing, trainual.com helps you with your mail, um, not mail, sorry, training. Leadfeeder.com, same thing. This is what helps you out by seeing who visits your websites and delegating to them. Uh, Mad Kudos, <laughs> Kudu, sorry. <laughs> Helps you kind of uh, score your leads that are coming across your website. And then frontapp.com. This is a kind of a cool shared inbox if you've got different team or members, maybe your VAs or assistants that are working in different areas. Allows for people to see uh, and read your inbox and answer one instead of your traveler and stuff like that. So um, I don't remember what this one was for. Uh, this is kind of like a base camp, if I remember, at lasten.com, yeah. And here is the final. Um, here you go. Some of the other things that they use, Zapier integrates, integrates things together, Blossom, Sweet Process, Office Vibe. A lot of great other tools out there for you guys. Okay. There you go. Big kudos to Roland Fraser for sharing these on SlideShare for all of us. Questions, comments, concerns. I know I went through a lot there. Go to SlideShare. Go to that. There's the link for you. Go download and take a look at that. Uh, i got a question here. Uh, John. Wasaki says, a couple of weeks back, you went over words not to include in your business name. Could you review those again? Or give a link where you got these. Thanks. Uh, yeah, John, just go back to my uh, Are You Effable uh, on the week on uh, either Vimeo.com, Week Close Notes, or YouTube.com. Th those words will be in that uh, PowerPoint presentation. I don't have them off the top of my head. So just go back to the Are You Effable uh, replay of Note Night in America from a few weeks back. Okay. Any other questions, comments, concerns from everybody out there? I know I went through a lot of slides there. Um, not spend time diving in each one because there's a lot. We're still going through those, okay? Uh, yes, there's the email finder we talked about in San Diego. That's correct. Jim, that's right. Sid, you're welcome, bud. Good to see you. Hope everything's going well for you up in uh, D.C., Baltimore area, Maryland, Virginia area. Once again, everybody, if you're not a part of the WCN memberships, some of you guys may have joined us uh, late. Uh, starting next week, Note Night in America is, uh, will only be available live to our WCN crew memberships. So we'll still do the first oh, first Note Night in America each month will be open to the public, but everything else, second, third, and fourth weeks of the month will only be available to our WCN members. All right. So if you want to get signed up for that so you don't miss anything, go to wcnmembership.com. Uh, 
Just Christina, just go to slideshare.net, Roland Frazier. Same thing we talked about in the front end, okay? Uh, let's see here. Jim Myers says, your head is spinning. Yeah, I know. We had a, you trust me, my head spinned as well. He did that slide in less than 45 minutes. So he was running through it. I was taking notes on it. Uh, Helena says, how long does it take in a week to manage all the apps you include in your business? Um, look, we don't use all those apps. And this is the thing is we'll use an app. And then as long as we're using it, we keep paying for it. We don't use it. We find something better. We'll kill the other one and go from there. So like Buffer, you know, that app Zapier, once you kind of implement some of the things, it, it, it it's meant to streamline your business. Okay. Okay. All right, let's see here. Um, let's see here. How do, uh, let's see a question here. I'm going through here. Oh, Helena, we answer that. Laura asked a question. Will you do a, a show about setting up the back end of your business? Example, how you set up QuickBooks and accept payments from investors or suggest that can help with that. Yeah, if you drop me a message, uh, we're working on having an accountant come on board here in the next week or two to share some of the back end stuff with QuickBooks. I've reached out to a couple, just trying to finalize that, but that'll be available for, we're going to do that for the WC and crew members. So um, that'll be something we won't do for the public because it's something that's going to add a lot of value. So I would get, uh, like I said, that probably won't be the first of the month. It'll probably be a WC and crew membership one. So, all right. Of course, you could wait if you wanted to. You wait a month and hear about it on the uh, the Note Nine America podcast. But I think many of you will want to catch um, it live when we do it. Okay. Any other questions or comments? Once again, if you want to go to, let me put this in the chat roll here. Get signed up at http. Use the link that I'm posting in there to all panelists and attendees. If you guys are parts of the membership, you guys know that we add value to that. So that's one of the great things out there. Question here. Hell yeah, I'll sign up for that, right? Laura says. <laughs> well, it's just, yeah, I guess, besides just content here on the Monday night, Note Night in Americas, you're going to get swag. You're going to get discounts. You can come to the virtual workshop at no additional cost. You can come to Note Camp 7 at no additional cost. It's included in that monthly thing at $97 a month. If at any point you don't like it, you're canceled. You're more than welcome to cancel. No problem. All right. Jim says, absolutely worth it. Thank you, Jim Myers. Appreciate it that we do deliver that way. So, okay. Any other questions, comments for, uh, plus you get that sweet dollar sign shirt. Exactly. You know, the collector's item with our WC and like we close notes logo on the back there for you. <laughs> thought you'd like it, Jeff Wolf. But I thought I might have one to take with me, but it ain't coming in time. <laughs> Plus, we also, if we're at a special event, we also give you a special uh, recognition too. So take advantage, guys. WCNmembership.com. Get signed up at the $97 a month. And uh, we'll go from there. Any questions, comments, concerns for anybody joining us here? Let me see if anybody commented on YouTube. We have a couple minutes here still. Take advantage, guys. WCNmembership.com. All right. Looks good. Question here. I know. All of you would have wanted one. That's right, Jim. Not just the wolf band. Well, thanks for letting me know. It's worth it. We'll get one out to you here in the next week or two. All right, Shannon, stuff in the... Uh, oh, did I bring a copy of the book in? We got the books in that we're shipping out to. I guess it's a, kind of, it's a pretty cool swag bag this month coming out to everybody. So we're pretty stoked about it. A couple books and some other fun stuff. I almost gave it away there. Don't want to do that. All right. Well, that's going to wrap it up for this Note Night in America, everybody. Once again, thank you so much for those that attended here. Love to have you part of the Note Night in America every week. If you feel like signing up for the WCN membership, you find it. Hey, I, if I can't save you 97 bucks or help make you $97 a month in your note in a real estate business, I'm doing something wrong. And I know just on those previous slides, 
I'm going to save a lot of you, some of you a lot of more money in helping you with some tools. So go out, make something happen, everybody. And uh, we'll see you all later, everybody. Bye. Enjoy your week. See, for those that are going to be at, uh, for those that you're joining us in Orlando on Wednesday, see you at 10 o'clock. Really looking forward to it. Um, tell you what, if you're not in Orlando and you sign up for the WCN membership, I'll send you a live stream feed uh, included with it. All right. So if you sign up for the WCN membership, I'll send you over a link to watch the live stream if you're not going to be in Orlando. How's that sound? All righty. See you there, Elena. You're welcome, Laura. Good night, everybody. Bye.